little nigga don't know it get dangerous. Danger. Ooh. 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 Danger. Yeah. Ooh. Charles, Davis, Charles, Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Godman. Charles, you talk about scorelines in this one. I think okay. it begins okay. and okay. ends okay. with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, I look like a hell of a good game, game. Your team's not going to benefit at all. Here's the Australian born punter Mitch Wisnowski. Ain't no way this going. nigga okay, Chris McCarthy. From Santa Clara. And he will be brought down here inside the 20. Good coverage as he's dropped at the 17. Stroud looks to throw on the first play. And bringing it in, oh, it's Davis. Fuck? And he is out of bounds right around the 34. 17 yards on the game's opening play and a quick first down. Nice little nifty play for him there. Yeah, that's the ability to read a defense and utilize players that don't often get picked up in coverage easily. And I'm talking about being able to use the backs out of the backfield. Ooh, I damn that cow pitch fast as fuck. Oh, he just stuck out there. Touchdown! Yeah, bro. I'm gonna call on. But I did a blitz, though. I actually just two plays on their opening drive to take the early lead. Now for the extra point, Daniel Carlson. I did a blitz by accident. That was on. And he's got it. Seven nothing Broncos. Following the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Carlson. Miles Sanders now to return it. And the tackle going to be made right there at the 25-yard line. Well, Ed, tell me what you're doing first. On the set. Drill, 52. Green jacks. Light blue. Needle blue. Jordan Love ready on first down here. Man open, that's Debo Samuel. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. So a first and ten now in Denver territory at the 49-yard line. Love looking to throw it. Back to Debo Samuel for consecutive catches. And he's going to get this one down to the edge of the red zone. On first and ten, Love. He's going to be sacked. Back at the 23-yard line. So after the sack, they'll come up on a still manageable second and 13. Now Love. are able to match the opening drive touchdown against them with one of their own. Extra point right down the middle. And we are tied at seven. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 seven, seven here as the kick's away. Taken at the goal line. And able to get this out to the 25. The Broncos onto the field, ready to start their next drive. This drive here beginning probably with a pair of motivated groups. Remember, the offense scored a touchdown. Now Davis fumbles it. Oh, and one of the linemen on the other side has got it. And that will not fool him anyone. It'll go down as a completed pass, but it will lose a big chunk of yardage. Now a deep ball there on second down, but it'll wind up incomplete. They decided the opportunity was there and launched a deep ball. But he's unable to get away from the defender. Couldn't create space, couldn't uncover the end of the route, and that will wind up.
ends up incomplete. He dumps this off underneath. Here's Davis. And he's not going to sniff the first down here. He stopped at the 25. Stroud now on fourth down. Thank you, Drew. Thank you, Chase Young. Trying to tell you. Love for the don't like that, Chase Young, bro. First down, going to the air with Love. Oh, oh that sucks, bro. Shoot. They started this drive backed up against the wall by the turnover. But I love their fight. Planted their feet and forced the incompletion on first down. Throwing. Love. Got a man, it's Jerry Rice. And he gets it all the way down inside the 10. And mark him at the 5. Check White. They'll try to run with McCaffrey. Yes, sir. He's okay. going to take it in. Touchdown, San Francisco. Christian McCaffrey. We can get a touchdown run. run. And the 49ers have now taken the lead. Point after, right down the middle. And that makes the score 14 to 7. Here is Wisnowski to boot it away following the touchdown. This taken in at the goal line. That's what I got. Take it a yard or so past the 20, call it the 21. Gee, that's why I got that call. Denver offense at the line, ready to go. And Charles, we know that this offense is aggressive. We saw that last drive. They went for it on fourth down, didn't get it. Then they give up the touchdown. So now you feel like they really need to respond here. That's such bullshit, bro. Try to pick themselves back up. First and ten, it's Stroud. That's caught left side, the tight end pits. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. Another first down, this time on a gain of 19. Well, I think when they look at their offense, they think to themselves, weapons, weapons everywhere. And they want to move the ball around. They want to spread it to different people. But you absolutely know they want to get this man involved as well. And that's what they just did on that play. So from inside Niner territory now, this is first and 10 at the 38. And now the 49ers signal for a timeout okay, defensively. Ready. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. 60 Maverick, 60 Maverick. Three, three, seven Pirates, seven Pirates. And they'll throw it with Stroud here, first and 10. They'll drop this off for Davis. And the play goes nowhere. Losing yardage back near the 40 at the 39. Through one corner, 14-7, our score. <clears throat> Second and 11 now. Ready? Hey. Well, they get to Stroud, nowhere to go, and he goes down. Third and 15 here after the first and second down plays went in the wrong direction. Here's Stroud. Oh, the ball comes out on the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. And so far as the defense is certainly coordinated. Both levels doing their jobs in tandem. The back helping the front, the front helping the back. The pressure got home on that last play and forced him to try and throw through contact and short of the sticks. Fourth down, here's Stroud. He's got his turn. That's complete. And he is going to have a Bronco.
was fucking the good. A big one there to keep the drive moving I did not need so. to. Both sides were holding their breath there on that fourth I down hate play, when it and does the offense that, can breathe a sigh of relief. If both knew exactly where the first down markers were, you know the defense is trying to guard those sticks and try and keep people in front. But somehow, some way, those guys found a way to pick it up. So five yards here, five on the play, and it'll be second down. In motion is Ward. On second down, it's Stroud. And his throw is going to be incomplete. His back has been a dependable safety valve all game, so he went back to him when his first read was covered. Just unable to connect, so the play results in no game. Stroud now to throw. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. Problems on third down so far in this first half. Relatively small sample size, but they're now 0 for 3. And the average in the league, somewhere around 40% on third down for offenses. So what's the answer to this? Either convert them or don't get the third down in the first place. Get your big chunks of yards on first and second down. Thank you, Donnell Perriman. And it's intercepted. And the 49ers are going to get Dumbass, come on, the game. I dare you. Thank you. With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. And Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. Here's the Australian-born punter, Mitch Wisnowski, to get things going. And here we go. We're underway in Madden Ultimate Team. This fielded right at the goal line. And his guys will get the football right at the 20-yard line. Such bullshit. And all the way down to the 33-yard line. Last play, they didn't even get back to the line of scrimmage. Now they gain almost 40 yards here. Now Tomlin set up first and 10. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. Give him 10 yards on the pickup, and that'll make it second and a foot or so. with him because he's had a good week of practice or something in that area but they want him involved just as you said they want him to touch it either in the running game or the passing game but they must like the matchups they're getting and he will have the bears first down as they're able to move the sticks with a gain of four on third and inches thomas goes in motion left Going quickly here to Thomas. This will be a five-yard pickup as they move it from the 20 to the 15. Now second and five. 
Play fake. Here's Love. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Picked off by the great one, Darrell Rivas. And bulldozing his way through. That's kind of a double whammy. I mean, the interception on the opening drive, that's one thing. But to give him this field position, that's another. Absolutely perfect start for this defense. They take the ball away on the opening possession. They know that their offense will get the ball to start the second half. They line them up in field goal position. And to me, they got a chance for a touchdown right here. He's going to be sacked back at the 23-yard line. Now, following the sack, they'll look to make amends on a second down and 17. To throw now. Here's Love. And a incomplete. Oh, that would have been six points, but somehow he couldn't rein it in. Oh, that's some good closing speed there defensively because that looked open for a minute. But that's great work with the ball in the air. Never gave up. Converged on his man and broke the play up. And he will be brought down at about the six-yard line. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Now Love. And this will be swung out wide for Taylor. Touchdown, Washington. Jonathan Taylor from six yards away. And the Commanders use the early turnover to get on the board first here in this one. Gladly take that. Well, we know he has decent hands out of the backfield. That's the first time, Charles, they targeted him in the passing game, and it pays dividends. And I love the design, too, because they kept him in the backfield and made the defense then run first before they swung him out of there. And you're right, with his hands, they might want to throw it to him just a little bit more. Here is Wisnowski to boot it away following the touchdown. This taken in at the goal line. And he's going to be taken down on what will be the final play of this first quarter. After 1-7-0 on EA Sports. The Bears with the football. We get set to begin quarter number two. As they get set to start their drive with a first and ten. At the line, prepping for their next drive, the Bears offense. In a close game like this, Charles, those interceptions like they had on the last drive could be costly, but here they've got another opportunity to seize control of this game. And they'd better take advantage of it because otherwise, if they end up losing... And he's got to go safety. into the end zone, and this is going to wind up a safety. So troubles here offensively. I tell you, the noise in this dome, that has got to make it harder for these guys to hear. Sometimes I find myself shouting up here. But you're right, if you can't communicate well or get off the snap count properly, it can cause big problems, and this qualifies as a big problem. This is taken at about the 14. Dang, young book didn't have to hit Jay Rice like that. Carry by Taylor to start the drive. And he takes this up to the 40 yard line before being corralled. So quickly all the way up at the 40 yard line. <laughs> to pass, here's Jordan Love. Well, this one complete, it's Rasheed Rice. And he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside <clears throat> the 40. It's another first down as they bite off 23 more on that one. Throwing. Love. They'll set right up power. the screen to Taylor. Wait, what'd you say? And down he goes, taking it inside the 10, just shy of the 5 at the mm. 6. 
Big gains in succession. Last one was over 20. This one over 30. Now Try to stab to a white play. lady kid. Really it's first and goal just outside the five. They'll run here with Taylor. And he's in. Touchdown, Commanders. Oh, he's done it again. From Taylor with his second touchdown here in this first half. Who the fuck am I going to let White power, motherfucker. The fuck? Why he pounded, motherfucker? Here is Wisnowski to boot it away following the touchdown. And he'll elect not to run with it. The fair catch will move this out to the 25-yard line. The Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. And now their hill to climb has gotten taller. They had the safety last time they had the football. That led to the touchdown a moment ago. So that deficit going in the wrong direction as they try to right the ship here. First and ten. When you struggle on offense, you're looking for anything possible to get you going. Sometimes you do it like basketball teams that don't normally press. You put a press on, bring people to life, make them move a little bit quicker. Maybe that'll help them as they head towards the half. Two minutes remaining in this first half of football. Ready, ready. Mm -hmm. Love now to pass on first down. Swinging this ball out here. I'm fucking good. And he'll be taken down at the 46-yard line. On second down, it's Tomlinson. And he'll be taken down at the 46-yard line. Oh, smack the shit out of that goddamn pass. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. I don't give a fuck, nigga. You put it one of my dead. You put it one of my dead for me, man, nigga. So they accept the penalty, of course, and push the offense backwards a bit. Yo, what? The delay of game backs him up five, first and 15. Trouble, 38. It's in the tight end, Davis, in motion. Six. Off the play fake, Love. Flush to his right. And a big loss here as he's taken down. Multiple defenders getting to him there for a huge loss. Well, you're already up a couple of scores here in the first half defensively, and Charles, they just seem to be playing really free on that side of the football. I love the observation because with that type of a lead, they feel like they can take a few more chances and be even more aggressive, and it's been paying off for them so far this game. A second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. The pressure really ratcheting up. They get the sack on first down, then a near sack. They got to him there just as it was leaving his hand. Yeah, they might need to change their pass protection scheme a little bit. Maybe bring another guy into the backfield to help protect the quarterback, because that was awfully close. Now the throw on third down, knocked away and incomplete. Nice back to oh, this nigga is ass I'm playing against, bro. Two in completion, they're going for more. No, I'm playing against him, they're going long. There's already 16 0 in the first half. Throw for it here. Well, ultimate team, done. Eric Berry, pick. Pick six. Pick six, Eric Berry. Oh my fucking. Bro. This team is nasty. Well, my ultimate team. So they go on fourth down. Not only do they not get it, it turns into six points the other way. Oh, yeah, that nigga quit the game. That nigga out of there. That nigga.